Look at us. Ah, stardust is hard. My life has become nothing but stardust. Let's see. This gear thingy. Stardust is item request fulfillment. I'm out of royal crystal, so I just have to deal with it. Oh, oh this one's make a glyph imprint. Okay, easy enough. That's just stationary crafting. Magical pen. Let's just make one. Oh, blah, 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 blah. thank you very much for the sub, Tachi. Wow, that's 11 months. I'm More than a year. Yeah, 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 yeah. That reminds me. Exactly. I need to ask Sneaky for something. Oh? Every single time you say Sneaky, I'm thinking of Sneaky, the League of Legends player. <laughs> I feel like people like the two tail one a lot, so I wanted to make like the year and plus ones, like crystal versions of the two tail. Oh, that's so pretty. That would be amazing. Oh, no, 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 the stupid thing for Velvast, all 5,000 points, and I have a far dark back now. I am so happy to be done with that. Oh, that quest was such a pain. But it's over now. You get this cute little bag. And it picks up phantasmal remnants for you, and the best part, it doesn't conflict with other doll bags. Okay, lingering darkness. And then a glyph imprint. Let's do glyph imprint real quick. Magic parchment. Mm, let's just do two. Yes. Actually, wait. No, let's just do one. Because I remember there's this stupid thingy where it's um. Glyph imprint. I am too lazy to like redo my griff. My wow, well, my griff. <laughs> I have a new glyph design. I did it for like a recent thing. It I really like how it came out, but it's such a pain to draw, and it would take me like five minutes to draw it. So I'm not gonna do it. Cool. I got a deliver the goods. No, it's this one. The white stars. Okay. I will show you the new one. Also, that means I can attempt now. I want to level Smart Flare some more first. Increase. Seven. Oh. Darn it. Wait, this still uses simples? Wait, do subskills only use simples? Is that how this works? Do like the smaller subs. Oh wait, no, I just misclicked on something. Okay, I was about to say. I was like, ha. Huh? Okay. We're making progress. Okay. So. Next thingy. Looking at my material list, I'm definitely starting to run short on C grade materials. Black paint. Make three of them. What is the requirement? Garbage. Garbage. Mm. Right. Thinkies. I think I might have enough garbage herbs. So, Indra, how's your day going? Uh, no 
NASA. I would think it would be under, where is the fetch, fetch pad. There we go. I've got enough garbage herbs. Okay, let's just make the black paint then. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Oh wait, I need three bottled waters. Well, your stardust also makes you, also wants you to make paint. I highly recommend just keeping three bottles on you at all times. There's like too much useful. The one thing I don't like is I think the... Okay, there we go. Yeah, I have like four bottles on me at all times. Just to be safe. It's so much pain otherwise. Also, my guild leader said that um, we'll do 70s tomorrow and if I do well... Um, I might be allowed to run my first 80, so I'm really looking forward to that. I have to study later tonight for it again. I studied it before, but I always like refreshing myself and making sure that like I'm on point for what I need to know. I don't know. Like maybe, I guess it's just me, but like the way that I tend to look at content is, especially if it's like my first time in it. I will try very hard to be... Oh wait, can I not? I'll have to make one at a time. <clears throat> <clears throat> I'll try very hard to be prepared and like ready to go. You don't have to teach me anything. I know everything. All it is is putting it into practice. Maybe shot calling for like things that I have cues that I haven't seen enough practice on. Stuff like that. Where... Like, for example, the difference between 70 and 80 is, like, for example, on the, what do you call it? The thingies, where we have to kill the three, the six, the four apostles. On 80, you have to use specific types of DPS against them. So, like, I wanted to know ahead of time, like, just off the top of my head, if someone were to, like, all right, go, all right, go get the yellow one. I need to know what that means, like, ahead of time. And so, there's quite a lot of things I need to learn, but... If I can get through the 80%, I think that'll help a lot. Also, I know that, um... That thingy are, um... Like, it's red. Like, you have to do... Like, they're... It's weird because they're strong against certain types. Like, red is strong against melee. Like, yeah, that's heavy standard. That makes sense. Blue is strong against ranged. Which is kind of weird. I would think it would have been gold, you know? But no. Make a broadsword. I think I have the manual for that, but what are the materials for a broadsword again? Broadswords are. Let's see. Broadswords are iron ingots and silver ingots. And then the finishing is fine leather and thick thread ball. I think I have a bunch of iron ingots, but I think I'm a little. I might be a little short on silver ingots. Let's go look. Smith stock. Mmm. I must have put the iron ingots in my actual inventory. Got tons of iron ingots. What about silver ingots? Oh, I have plenty of both, actually. Plus, I'm a crazy crafter, so I can go do that. And then fine leather. And then thick bed. I'm almost out of thick thread balls again. No, not like this. Uh, I just gathered a bunch the other day and I did a bunch of stardust off stream and it was just like, now I'm almost out again. 
Also, my order for emotes is almost done. We just finalized all the last emotes. So I am super duper looking forward to um, showing everyone all sorts of new emotes. And then, um, I want to do, oh, I am just asking, I'm talking to Sneaky right now, who is doing them. I just need to show them the references for the tales. Um, where did I put my tails? <clears throat> Are they under Aki? No, they're probably under emotes. No? Huh. <clears throat> I don't know where I put them. I remember, like, they had their own folder. Oh, let's go over there. Found it. Um, open file location! Go, go, go! Okay, I found it. Okay. Wait! Wait! Let's go make a broadsword. So what are you two up to, you uh, Tachi? <clears throat> Hugging some... Roshaz one twos. Ooh, nice. I'm doing some stardust. Well, you two are doing a stardust. I feel like it's like kind of nice and relaxing when everyone's just like chilling out and just doing things together sometimes uh, other times not as much but <clears throat> today is a day where apparently I am a derp and don't actually have a blacksmith a uh, broadsword manual no nope, there it is I was like I, I could have sworn I had one to the homestead <clears throat> I'm not disturbing you, am I? Oh, no, not at all. Oh, wait, I should also get... <clears throat> I was also going to, like, put things up in the background, and I entirely forgot because I am dumb sometimes. <clears throat> um, let's see. What would I like to put on? Let's go with this one. <clears throat> oh, wait. Station two instead of three. Did you try your signet yet? I did. Unfortunately, didn't go out there. Ah. You accidentally pressed the Lord's button. Wow! Congrats. Oh, I can't use the pouch, apparently? That's odd. Cool. 
There we go. This is so weird that it's like bugging out. There we go. Oh, apparently I can't change my outfit. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. And we're done with our broadsword. Oh my god, hi Ronnie! Thank you so much for the raid! Wow, thank you so much! That is so kind of you, thank you so much! <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hello everyone, it is a pleasure to meet you all. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you so much for the raid. Hi Zvoli! <laughs> Hi Ronnie, how was your stream? I was feeling kind of sick earlier, so like I was just derping around. But how was your stream? Also, look, I moved up the the two that you are the most fond of, and I made them cheaper to make it nice to care for. Oh wow. Congratulations! That's so wonderful! I'm happy for you! Congratulations! <clears throat> I'm um... And remember... See? It's much Hydrate easier to find now! Or die. <laughs> and you can uh, save your voice. <laughs> 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 Hi, hi, hi. <clears throat> so, <today. laughs> Deflection power. Lingering darkness. Let's go do that. Thank you so much. <laughs> hey, thank you for the head pat, are you? Hello, hello, hello. Been a while. How have you been? No, thank you. I really appreciate your lurks as well. It's so kind of you. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm very happy. So there. Tailteen. Oh no, Lingering Darkness is Tara, actually. I'm such a derp sometimes. I've been working a lot on things. Thank you for showering me with hearts, Ria. <laughs> you could use flood with hearts too. It costs 300 and you've basically spent that. <laughs> Thank you. If anyone needs help with their Stardust or like advice or things like that in Mobby, please let me know. I'm relatively strong when it comes to Mabinogi as well. I like doing a lot of content, helping people, teaching things, and just doing what I can. Thank you for the fun. Hi, Lumi. How are you? <laughs> I'm currently drowning. Help me. I can't get out. <laughs> Help me. I'm drowning. There is no... Sh the shadow room shall be conquered with love. <laughs> uh, I forgot to turn off Instant Thunder. It did work! I am completely overflowed in hearts. <laughs> but yeah, I love teaching things about Mabinogi. I like running high-end content. I usually really enjoy just helping everyone learn things about the game, teaching neat tricks, tips, and also just getting to see some like really high-end content. 
today is just more of a chill day. I figured like sometimes it might be harder to approach me during like while I'm focusing on running like super high content. And sometimes people are just like chilling out and just want to see the content and not necessarily feel like comfortable asking questions. So I figured I'd do like a Stardust in chat day where we can just hang out, chat. I can answer any questions people have, interact with everyone, and just overall just have fun chatting. I am kind of hyped for Dark Mage as well. Especially with me being like an old chain main <clears throat> before I switch back to melee. Like, I know that Dark Mage is mostly still magic, which kind of makes me sad, but... I hate that this thing is still doesn't fire properly. Oh wow. My, uh, blast is actually getting pretty strong. I am more hyped for Alchemic Stinger, especially since I turned into an alchemist, but it seems like it's more of an archery thing. It's weird because the both of the new Arcana coming out, I'm, like, very strong in those talents, but I'm strong in those talents on the weapon that they don't use. a little disappointing but I also like I, I, I am <clears throat> let me rephrase that you knew me good at archery back when like having a baffle was like holy crap you actually have one that's like a super legit OP holy cow and I was like the only human who had one on our Alexina for a bit <clears throat> and like actually mained archery well not the only human but one of the few My archery gear has not moved up since then, so I can actually still show you. I have an equipment slot for archery still. I see I still have, like, LE6, R7. <clears throat> I still have my um, crash shot. I need to re-roll this because it's still, like, final hit. But I still have, like, the dual reforge magnum shot crash shot fragment damage. I just need to get our ruin bow, yeah. <clears throat> And I think my shoes have final hit teleport, so I need to re-roll my shoes and my hat. And I think I still kept one of my magnum shot accessories. Yeah, I did. So, I still have a little bit. Also, look! I max rolled my creepy! I wanted to replace my, um... That one off enchant that I had, so I got creepy again. And it max rolled this time! I'm really happy about that. And my Haunted is near max rolled here, so that's... I am pleased. Good job. Thank you! While I'm here, I might want to run the Lords. Anyone care to join for, like, Master of Corb Cabin? Or if we have enough people, want to join for doing, like, the one on the boat? I don't remember what it's called. Master of Korob Cabin is the one that I usually do if there's only like a couple people. And if there's more people, usually switch to Fragments of a Trivial Fate. Yes, thank you. Fox on a boat, exactly. You know what I'm talking about. Good stuff, right? <laughs> That's the good stuff. The floof on the boat. My back cracks under the sea breeze. Too salty for me. <laughs> it's fun though. Any takers? Because if not, I'll just do one quick run of Cat Convoy. It goes by in like 40, maybe 50 seconds. Let's wear that gear. You'll see what I mean. It's pretty fun. Oh wait, is this the wrong one? 
Oh, this is the wrong one. Sorry, I meant Master of the Cabin. Sorry. The convoy takes too long. <laughs> yeah, I just misclicked. Oh well. Forget to heal. I'm just gonna level up. <laughs> Thank you for your concern, though. I'll just heal by leveling up. And still flame is on, and let's go. Point, point. See? Level up. They're pretty spread out today. Go, 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 go! Go fast! Gotta go fast! Wait! Yes, I'm very excited for the new cats. See? Mission's done! Knocked a quick one out. I did not make a hailstorm combo card. I started working on an alchemy card. I have. I like my water cannon card too much to like work on that, so I'm making a flame burst card. And yes, this was my final hit armor. It's long lasting fortification and just has final hit duration 20 on it. Here's my combat armor. It's long lasting heroic, but has assault slash limit break and shock stun duration double reforge. I like shock a lot. I like to throw shock on myself. They're mine now. Thank you so much, Remy's Lost. Thank you, hello, hello, hello. I like reforged it a bunch of time and that was like the one good limit break that I got. I was like, please, let me get a useful limit break for once. And it was like, here you go, assault slash. I was like, yes, yes. <laughs> uh, I'm going to be so excited when I get the new round of like, I'm, I ordered like, I think it was a total of like 16 new emotes or something crazy. They're gonna be so fun to use. I'm really looking forward to it. While I continue working on Aki. Like the VTuber. Okay. We did that. Alright, let's try to get Flare up some more. Come on, hit the mark. Yes! That's level 8! Let's go! Can we get level 9 in one tap? Aww. Okay. Espresso. Espresso is water and roasted coffee. How does one acquire a roasted coffee? It's corporal coffee beans and water, but how do you get the corporal coffee beans? That's a lot. I'm lazy. I'm not willing to redo it. <laughs> Switch your crusts. Glyph recovery with fragmentation. All right, cool. Homestead time. So wanted to change background to let's see where's the choir one oh no there it is sata 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 fragmentation Uh, 
Huh? How am I how am I efficient at this? I always feel like I'm not. I think I'll throw away that one. Oh, do you mean just having like everything prepared ahead of time? Yeah, I've gone through like two or three more. The, the shadow mission came back. <laughs> and that's one of the tens. At this rate, I might actually end up having to like make new glyphs. I can salvage that one. That reminds me, I need to remember to cast my chain glyph when I'm in Chrome. I'm always forgetting to do that. Sate, sate. Toshiokana. Wait, no, don't fragment that one. Oh, I accidentally fragmented it anyway. Okay. Doing fun, doing fun. So how's everyone else doing today? Everyone getting their own stardust done, making some good progress, having fun, clearing content that you need. Those 5,000 seasonal ducats. Can I, can I reset that one? Nope. All right. Guess I'm gonna go do Albi Int. Hi. Do, 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 do. Hi. Arabi Into, yatemimasu. Hi, 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 hi. Arabi, Arabi. Hi. And then Dungeon Guide, I'll be. I'll just play Mobby Tracks. Have you ever heard the version of the Mabinogi's, uh, an old tale from grandma that actually has lyrics? Congrats, Foley. You've been getting pretty far as well. Of lightning rod in the background. Let's do normal rolling. Dynavolt into this so it'll run into it. Flip over here. Let's go. And there we go. <laughs> Hello, Rich. How are you today? a very casual stream just feel free to ask any questions have fun 
enjoy hanging out. Borger? Have you come from Lumi? This feels like epic speed run music now. Ah, uh, that lightning rod felt good. Let's go. Indra, did you see my lightning rod? <laughs> I like how like ads just started so like anyone who doesn't have the sub is like dungeon's gonna be over better. And that's it. Dungeon clear. A long sword? Oh an advanced pass. Let's pick that up for now. Point. No, I still have the combat bug. Let's leave. Also, my inventory is a nightmare. When it's bugged out like this, though, I really don't like the book. Like, I could have just dungeon guided back faster. No, the fact that, like, I started pre charging it, the wave spawned in and everything was spawned in in exactly the right way to make the, like, lightning rod actually useful. Not the damage. I'm not a mage. I'm also spamming, clicking, and spacebar at the same time to make my conversations go super fast. Spacebar let, like, one click, like, spacebar lets it instantly finish, and then if you click right after that... Ooh, let them fight. Um, is there anything good in the dungeon guide from let them fight? Actually, what's my journal score on let them fight? Let's see. I don't see let them fight in here. Did I just miss it? Hmm. It's just further down. Yes. Okay, I haven't done hard or beginner or elite on that. Alright. Cool. Thank you for the lurk, Tachi. Greatly appreciate it. Also, nice MVP in this arc. I just saw it touchy. Let's see, let them fight. What even is let them fight? Oh, I don't have the passes for it. I'll do it later then. I'm not sure if actually... What do you have to do? Oh wait, is it the thing where like you have to like lure the explosions over to the zombies? Is it that one? 
<laughs> it is this one. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I'm done. On the bright side, the nice thing is that if you are zoomy with your pet, you can kind of do it quickly. Okay. First one's good. Like, what I tend to do is I don't actually fight until I've placed all the targets. I don't know how that got placed as the target, but whatever. That's one next one. Let's divine link here. That'll get both of those. Next one. It is, like, I hate this one. Oh, use the Chrome tech and push them together with Wind Blast? That is a good idea. Like, my problem is that, like, I feel like by the time I grouped them up, I could have just hit them separately. So I've never actually tried it. Because then, like, after that, I just go around and just be like, boop, boop. Ah, this one. Unless I mess up like that. But yeah, you're right. I should probably try Wind Blasting it. I'll do it on the wave after this one. hit these. Warp back. I'll try one blasting on the next wave of these. Oh, they're just spamming counter on me now. Feels bad. Can I knock them into it? Uh, nope. There we go. Alright, let's try the wind blast strat. There's the background blast. I'll just let that one go off. Oh wait, this is the only group. All right, let's just one blast y'all over there. And shock. And then I can just leave that one. Actually, on this one. Get over here. That should be just close enough. Nice. Oh, uh, not actually. Okay. Let's get this one. Okay. One, two, three. Oh. And go. Ah, that doesn't work. I thought it would. Oh well. This should do it. I'm really excited for it, actually. I did a little bit more studying, but I'm gonna study a little. I'm gonna do it again after stream just to make sure that I'm like a okay and ready to go. I'm like super excited. I'm glad that we're doing like a 70 to warm up. I got my level up for it too. I'm like super excited for that run. I'm like really looking forward to it. Are you? Teehee. I also, like, kind of want to do a stream where, like, I try to solo 30 Chrome. I'm worried about the wipeout room, though. Okay. 
Come on, please hit, please hit. One more. Come on. And then I'll come back. Yes! Level 9! Let's go! <laughs> uh, no. Since all of my, like, high damage skills are all AoE, I'm, like, raising up Flare first. And I got, like, everything to, like, level 8 or level 9, depending on, like, the effectiveness of it. So, let's get this to level 3. Oh, wow. I failed at level 2. I failed the 90%. What is this luck? Why am I like this? <laughs> ah, pain pickle. Okay, let's see. That should be enough time for me to reset the life one. No? Okay. Let's look at Core Fragment Collection then. Let's do... C-Rank. It's a Tail Shadow Realm. Crag Hound. When I hit Pallid. <laughs> if only. <clears throat> if I actually hit Pallid. I'm going to be torn between selling it and keeping it. Because I actually do like, like archery. I even still have like my original setup from like years and years ago. My four archery skills over here on my backup slots. I just didn't want to get rid of it, you know? Yeah. My problem is I don't think I have the rest of the materials that are necessary. the moment yeah i'm working on the nightbringer but that's about it <clears throat> i'm also trying to farm shadow realm champion so i can get the steel enchant but that's all like i'm also thinking about like what can i upgrade for the most part <clears throat> i'd also like to get like a new hat to wear for bard or something so i can get chorus on that and then i have a resistance enchant for my hat i want to put resistance on I do not. That's the thing. I pulled a few gotcha rounds for them, and I wasn't lucky enough to get one, unfortunately. And I don't have the funds to buy one outright. I was gonna try to get one for, like, instead of getting, like, the true, maybe, like, get the one that- I think it's the shoes? From the newer gotcha that have the shoes. Oh, okay. Wait, seriously? 
I should get, I should pick that up then. What is it called again? Is it Trobador hat and wig? Is it because the gloves are so much better? Holy, no wait, the gloves are that, the shoes. Oh, the boots are stronger, that's why. They're plus 30. have the hat now. Now for my bard set. <clears throat> I can throw it in here and then hit check mark. Yay! All set. Okay, let's go. Okie dokie, let's see. Switch into a rank A combat. Apostle Raid! Time to go solo gear. Hello! Thank you very much for the follow, Chip! <laughs> Thank you, I really appreciate that. Appreciate it. So not quite. And play. Ah, uh, that proximity issue. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, no, point. Solo gear gives pain pickle. Let's flip over that. Rage impact, back up. Oh, I thought I could flip through that really quickly. That one was a good flip. Wait! 
せーのはいそれでこれでほい Alright, this is where I do some of my corgi and with the whale, do some of this. Oh, my alarm is going off. I should fix that. Wee! I'll get that in a sec. Uh, I can get it right here. Wait. Wait. And this is where I need my corgi back. And with that knockback, I should be able to de link before things get too bad. This crystal phase is the worst. Right, let's do. Four, one, five, three. Oh wait, I don't have support shot queued up anymore. Oh, that's unfortunate. Ow! Oh, 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 oh. Wait. Uh, Corgi, get me out. That's gonna be yep, right here. Dealing with this one is I don't necessarily like this mission, but it's also like a good excuse for me to get some apostle EXP. During this phase, I just have my corgi attack non stop because it's just like. It's gonna keep grabbing me. Whee! Spin me right now. <laughs> oh, and here comes the grab. Impact into Denival right here. Uh, that bug. Where did Corgi go? Ah, blah, 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 blah. Far so good. Can I right. one more push?
Hello. Hello. Welcome back. <clears throat> How's your Stardust going? Oh, I just did a few quests and then got bored of it. Ah, I see. <sighs> it's getting very expensive. Oh yeah, the attempts are stupid expensive. <clears throat> On this, like a hundred k attempt. I know, right? Ugh, mood. Totes agreed. So, Chipmunk, what are you up to? And yeah, yeah, what are you gonna do now? I was just booting up Animal Crossing to decorate more. Oh, cool! The heart pawn that you made was amazing last time you showed me. Mm. I really like the checkerboard with like the flowers that you made. I'm working on my house this time. I need a whole Ooh. living room that's pink. Okay. Let's do another Master Rank quest. And Master of Corb Cabin! Yo! Time for another Lord mission. Do you want to come or nah? Or are you going to play on Animal Crossing? Oh, I'll come if you want. Sure. I keep doing that. I always feel like really bad when I pick up the life quest and it's just like, it's such a pain to do, I don't want to do it, and then I just do like a bunch of combat quests instead. Some of these musics. <clears throat> are from Mobby, and I like, I don't actually know where they're from, some of them are. Like, everything I've been playing after, like, when I switched over to, like, the choir has been Mobby related. And, like, the one that just stopped, I don't actually know where that's from. Does anyone else know where that's from? Oh, I forgot to switch my armor back to the final headset. Hello! Okay, my balls are out. Nice fireball! Char Charlene is mean. Like, why? Why you gotta be like that, Charlene? Nice fireball. You died. Night of Round? Is that a different MMO or a different thing? Good job! Your fireballs are really good for clearing this. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Mm-hmm. My spirit weapon's about to be level 100. Congratulations! That's huge! Oh, you mean Knights of the Round, the Baltane mission? Yeah. That one's annoying. Um, my advice for that one, use chain, stand in the middle, near the spikes, and then just whip the dogs with your chains. Thank you for coming on the run with me. Do you want to do any other runs? Like, do you want help with your Stardust any at all? Um, I don't have any Stardust quests, but I'm up for doing whatever. Okay. I will let you know what mine is in a sec. If they assign me that for Stardust, then I'll show you the strat. Otherwise, I can show you it too if you want. Um, 
Well, let's add in my quest, change that, do rank C. Or let's do another rank A. Piaka Int. And a basic leather armor. Basic leather armor is fine fabric, fine silk, and common leather times three, four, three to four attempts. Let's see. Fine fabric. I don't have enough fine fabric for that. Interesting. So, Yuya, want to do Piaka Int then? Sure, if you need a uh, fabric, I have some. Thank you very much for the offer. That said, anyone else in chat want to come for Piaka Int? You hate all the cooking and tailoring and blacksmithing ones. Half of the cooking ones are okay. The, some of the tailoring ones are also okay, and some of the blacksmithing ones are okay. The upper third of the tailoring and blacksmith ones are, like, ridiculous. Um, in terms of the fabric, yeah, I think you should save it for your own Stardust. I'm just gonna um, reset I, the quest. Hmm? Uh, okay, I skipped those anyway, now. Oh, okay. If you, no big deal. if you don't mind, then maybe I might take some. Let me just double check the resources on this. I have enough fine silk and I know I have enough common leather. You should kill these. They look very cute. Hello. Hi. It's just PTSD. I mean, I got to Dan 3 blacksmithing way, way, way back in the day. Ironically, the best way to prove this is show that I have Dan 3 and show that I don't have the blacksmithing title. Because it was still the thing when you had to like actually finish all the requirements. So, I used to do lots of blacksmithing. I, uh, have quite a few of those where I'm like... I gotta expand that. There we go. Yeah, I have a lot of, like, ones where it's like, like, I think I don't have Master of Tailoring either. Because I got Dan 3 back when it was, like, impossible to get the Tailor Master title. Where it was like, you needed to make something stupid, like, I think it was like, you had to do like 2,000 pieces of rank 1 clothing or something absolutely insane. Like at base. And I was just like, no. This is CR that. Okay, Piaka in. Thank yous for coming, Yuya! And Yuni, if you can hear me, thank you for coming as well. If not, I'll just type it in chat. I'm not afraid of no ghosts. I ain't afraid of no sleep. I ain't afraid of no bed. <laughs> Sleeping makes me feel good. <laughs> wow. Zoom in. 
huh? Stuck. You gonna pick up any of the new kitty pets? I might. I haven't looked at their details and stuff on what they have yet, but I might. I haven't decided yet. Okay, there's two. I'll do over here. Oh, thank you for the overture. Hmm. Zoom me, doggy. Unique has an OP crash shot. Corgi is like so hyped up. It's going zoomy, 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 zoomy. Oh. Um, Indra, not yet. I had to put it off. I had to travel out of state for a while and do like a bunch of stuff. And work got insane, where like I was doing 12 hour days. I just didn't have the time to organize it properly. But I'm thinking of actually going back to the organizational thing for that. So if you're interested in joining, there's still time. Corgi is at for six out of ten. Okay. Why do we always get like the super epic battle themes when we're speedrunning? What did you do to them, Rich? A lot of spooters. I'll have spooters in my homestead. <laughs> Feels bad. I've had that happen- I've been on the receiving end of that a couple of times and it's just like... I always feel like... I feel like that- that person in the Twilight Zone... Um... Uh, where it's like all the time in the world. Or like the person he um is like always complaining and then he gets time like he it's like people keep won't let him read and then he finish and then like everyone in the world like disappears and just leaves him and he's like finally I have time and then his glasses fall off his face and break on the ground and he's like no it's not fair there was time now and he's just like stuck there because he can't repair his own glasses and he can't see without them. I feel like that when that happens where it's just like, it's not fair. I had so much damage. I was doing so well and then they just got lucky. Uh, I forgot these are melee immune. I bet you by the time I finish, like, actually... Oh wait, there's a demi- there's a Master Lich. I can just kill the Master Lich. What am I doing? I'm Dumper. Goodbye! Oh, 
with a stun. Oh, thank you. In case anyone else needs the heal to get through this here, I put down a healing glyph. What is that? Uh, this black stuff? Mm -hmm. It's, um, I think it's called Embrace of Death. It's a skill Master Lich has that makes you unable to drink potions and deals like percent max HP damage per second to you. Wow, Mithril Lance Heavy Armor! Congrats! Is that rare? Yeah. And yes, it is from the Twilight Zone. Apparently Uni has a weird enchant! What does it do? What does it do? One-handed sword, dead was it Dawn, Icicle, something different? Dominator, what's that? I don't think I've heard of that. That's a really old enchant, I think. Hold on, Dominator. Dominator is suffix rank three, strength plus 10, eight to 15, Max crit five to eight times two repair cost. Yeah, it's an it's a super old enchant, but it's just really rare. Like I didn't know that that was possible to drop from here. Like even the wiki doesn't have that as information. It only says that you can get it from Fiat. And interesting. You... Yeah? Thank you for running with me, yeah? Are you there still? Oh, were you talking to me? Yeah, I just said thank you for running with me. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here, but mentally maybe not. <laughs> oh, I see. Uh-huh. And no worries. Take all the time. If you want to do something else, just let me know. We can just, you can just chill here. Is that directed at me? Yeah. Oh. Well, if you just get any other requests and you want company, you know, I'll Sure go. thing. Okay. I'll let you know. We'll find out what I have. And Zvoli, what I do for the base map for Stardust, it depends on what I'm after. If I I look at the title here, like the entire list of material, and I look at what I'm missing the most of, and then I take missions for that. So like right now, I don't really need B because you get through that pretty quickly. I think I'm fine on C here. I'm getting low on B materials here. So, oh, that reminds me, may I please have some, I think it was fine silk. I'll come back to you. Oh, you want the fine fabric? Yes, I think it was fine. I think it was fine fabric, yes. I only need t like 10. I think 10 would be enough. You said you don't have any, right? Like at all? I have four. So with that, I would be 14, and I think since I have Crazy Crafter, I would only need anywhere from 9 to 12, so that should be enough. So fully, does that answer your question? And thank you very much, Yeah, I'm coming back over to Piaka now. Give me just a sec. I return. Hello. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a lot. Are you sure? Add it to, add it to your stash for next time. Okay, thank you. I'll let you have back whatever I don't use. No, no, just keep it. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Let's see. 
basic leather armor. I believe that was blacksmithing or was it tailoring? That's tailoring. Okay, so in that case, talent, let's switch over to Grandmaster Tailor. If you end up needing thick thread again, I have over a hundred each half. Oh wow, thank you. That's a huge amount. I should do like you and stock up more. I like haven't been restocking oh. after I burned through them. I just been getting it for bartering. Oh. No, you should definitely yeah. keep those. You know, sometimes when you're bored, just knock out a few sheep. Mm hmm Oh, that's right! I have a pet that lets me do that. I should definitely. Thank you for the reminder. That helps a lot. Thank you. I entirely forgot about that. And Spully, grats on 15. If you don't mind, like, if you just want to get to 15 quickly, you can just do rank E of all of the things. Combat, I would still spam rank A just because combat, a lot of it doesn't really change all that much. Wait, is this EXP? This is EXP. Uh, I forgot to use my corgis thingy. Let's level up by selling this bow. Shoom. Okay. So we need tailoring. Where's my special tailoring kit? What's special about it? It's reforged. Oh! I know what I can use those calcified thingies on! Calcid. あの、ちょっとね。私、間違えちゃったのかなはい。はいはいはい。Useless reforges. Okay. Taylor stop. Oh wait, no, it would be pattern stuff, I think. Wait, where's my tailoring kit? I know it's green. Yep, here it is. It's 19 out of 20 quality! That's really nice. And then I made a purple dress that I used when I'm crafting too. It has designer oh. Dante. Remember when I was like in front of the popo dress? Yup. <laughs> You're like, why do you have this? Po why is you have a random popo dress in your inventory? And I'm like, this popo dress is worth like 30 mil. It is a popo. And a basic leather armor. Oh, no, so basic leather armor. Oh wow, this armor I got in the dungeon is 7 mil? Yeah. That's why I was like, congratulations, it's big. It's a really pretty outfit. Like, I still have one in my storage. Like, back from when it was used to be, like, super, super, super rare. And it's it's still really pretty, like, cosmetic. There... Too bad I can't preview it. <laughs> Wait, why can't you? I'm an elf. Oh, I thought it was a different armor. I thought that that he, one was- It says human giant only. Oh no, that's sad. I know. Basic leather armor. Oh, I kept this- I kept this manual even though it's broken and I can't use it anymore. Because it was like, once upon a time. 
I tailored rosemary gloves. And no, there is no reforge that is useful in the chess piece for tailoring. There is no reforge in general, aside from the one on the kit directly that is useful for tailoring. The only thing is making sure that you're in Grandmaster Tailor so you can get refunds on the materials. Okay. Okay. I need... I don't actually have basic leather armor, so I have to go pick it up, which is at Walter, Effie, Granite's or Nine. Let's get it from Walter. Oh, I still actually, in fully, I didn't, I didn't, like, indicate that just to be like, oh, I made the gloves once for someone else. No, I made my own gloves. I think I still have them. Yeah, see? I even I even sick them. But I was like, yeah. And like they're they're like near impossible to make these days. So I have a bunch of Avon shields. I used to lend them out to my friends. I had a bunch at one point. I remember trying to make it through blacksmithing. I got like, I put my manual into it. No wait, no I didn't. I got all the materials for it, including the manual. I went to the anvil and saw it was like, like it was still new enough that like the wiki didn't have the details like fully on it, I think, like on terms of like average amount per craft. And I saw that it wasn't gonna complete in one and I was like, how am I supposed to get more manuals for this? And then I realized that was why people were selling it on the marketplace and I just went, nope, 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 not happening. And I just gave up entirely. And then like, Six months later, they had events that just gave the shields out. I don't remember what the events were, though. Yeah, I was way too lazy back then. Well, not lazy. It was more like... Sword and shield wasn't necessarily good back then. And I'm not a giant, so it's like... I could do that. I could do that. But why? Uh no sa Where's the stupid armor? <laughs> Of course, it was the second to last pattern I looked for. Okay. I <clears throat> I made that back when I was in like high school slash early university, where it was like every day I would come home and I would just be like, I'm gonna go fish. And I would just set it up while I was doing like all my work and stuff and just leave it running. I'd leave it running overnight, come back in the morning, and it was just like, congrats, you've gotten nothing. <clears throat> and like back then like the ice silk and stuff for it like I just bought it off the market because like no one was trying to make it like ice silk was like 8 mil right now people were selling ice silk for like 20k back then because like no one was making the gloves because the manual was too hard to get and even if you got it it was like spirit staff didn't really exist yet like, in the form that it does now. I was on Alexina. So people were just like, oh, ice silk. Well, yeah, it's used for the gloves, but like, who's gonna make those? So they were just throwing it on the market. I remember getting like an entire stack of like ice fabric at one point for like 200k or something.
I made them fairly early in as well. I believe Ryu, I was probably fifth or sixth then because I remember, I think you let me use some of your manual uses before I got like my, I think you made yours and then you gave me the manual. Yes, intermediate magic was pretty bad. In general, like, we didn't have advanced magic either. Well, we had Hailstorm, but, like, the meta build was, if you were going to be a mage, you were using Fusion Bolt, Firebolt, Ice Bolt. But still, because, like, everything else was so much better than that, it was not super common. And back then, you still needed to do, like, what do you call it? Um, I don't think this does actually. I don't think I actually have a tailoring one. Hmm. I'll equip it just in case. Yes, I played an Alexina. I still have pets too that have like the hey, you are part of Alexina like name. See, here's one. I don't know if you- oh wait, you probably can't see because of the chat. See, there's one. Abyssal Kitty plus Alexina. So yeah. Hi! Nice, got it in three. That was pretty fast. I like the nice thing of the popo dress is that if you had it and you played the minigame like anywhere remotely reasonably well. Like, you're gonna sing. With the popo plus the tailoring thing. Yep, see? Dun, da, 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 da. <laughs> Thank you very much for the... For the fabric, yeah? Oh, you're welcome. I don't know why I keep trying to say silk and I keep like every time I say fabric I meant I like immediately say silk. You can just say silk. We'll all understand. <laughs> I mean if you have the materials for it, yeah, I'll, I can try. Let's put my popo dress away. Does signature have a function other than just clout? Um, signature generally is only applied when your quality is very high, so it's more like a side effect of having a very high quality piece of gear. Ah, okay. Sorry, high quality craft, I should say. In my opinion, if you're making a Saluna blade, you should make sure that, like, you're using someone who has like blacksmith stuff. Like this title or I like this title the most. This increases blacksmithing completeness even further is super, super impactful. Like, you know how the wiki says like it takes average of seven attempts to make a Celtic chain blade? I was very close to getting it in four with this title. I was 4% off. I think I got 27, 49, 63, and then 96. So Luna is one craft though. But yeah, I have the, at that point though, it's just the popo dress. Like there isn't really anything you can do too much more than that for blacksmith and the blacksmith Dan title plus doing it on the weekday for quality. One day as well. I don't have nearly enough material yet. Um, I forgot to farm for it for a while. I'm spinning around in circles, like forgetting what I was trying to do. Oh right, I can actually make attempts now. Uh, I'll hit this instead. 
Wow, I failed level 3 to level 4. That's an 80% rate and I failed it again. I failed it twice. Excuse me? I should have tried to hit my freaking smart flare. Are you seeing this? I just failed an 80% success rate three times in a row. That's really bad. I... I don't know how to react to this. Yeah, I guess I'm just ruining my RNG now. Eyebrow twitch? <clears throat> What'd you say? Your eyebrow twitching? Yes. My eyebrow <laughs> is definitely twitching. Just... Everything is okay. Everything is fine. Oh, cool. Craft two sundews. That's easy. Uh... But yeah, it'll just bounce back later in BD. I'm hoping I do. I would probably actually make the bow if I got it. I actually do kind of miss that tree. That's a lot. Uh, okay. Sun do, do, do. Funny enough, you mentioned archery. My good leader was trying to convince me the other day to do that. Oh? What, to make the bow? Or to do some- or to do archery in general, or what? like main archery. Mhm. Mm I just don't like how archery has such a huge emphasis on erg. Well, I mean a lot of talents do, but it's particularly important for archery. Well, for AoE at least, you can still do magnum without erg, but the main thing then is your Please give me another Stardew make. Good luck potion. I think that one was reasonable. I think I have four leaf clovers on me. Uh, my handicraft kit went somewhere. I have no idea where it went. Isn't that what your tailoring kit did? Yes. <laughs> I've dedicated space to perfecting. How much is an upgrade as Nightbringer up from a D-Blade? It's a pretty significant upgrade, especially if you get like a high craft. The max gets pretty high, and the thing is, it also gets lots of piercing. As if you get like a really good piercing enchant on top of having it, it might, against higher like defense foes, it's it might be comparable to Saluna at that point. I think Saluna is still like stronger just because of how much more max it has, but it starts, like the gap starts shrinking. The seven pierce is actually pretty significant. And people were saying like seven pierce versus four is actually enough. It has four base pierce, but has another special enchant like S Solitude does where you can get um, another plus three. I think it's like two pierce at base on craft and then you can upgrade it to have another two pierce as part of its normal upgrade path and then after that the enchant adds another three. Pretty OP. Okay. Um, I'm standing here just like blinking out now. Right, good luck. Um, you were looking for handicraft, right? I was looking to see, like, what, where I put my 
four leaf clovers. Oh yeah, it, the last one sold for like stupid amount. I think it's like 3.5 bill, something like that. I think it was 3 bill for like a bad craft. Oh, no, no one, I could have sworn someone sold it. Like, no, no one has sold it in this year. I thought I saw someone selling it once for like 3 bill or something, but it was like a low roll. But yeah, the hard part is just getting the materials for it. Like... I mean, it's like, Saluna is also like so patently insane to get that like, I think that we, I think even with the server merge, I think there's only like 20 on an A, something like that. The main part that's gonna like rip you up to pieces is the stupid mine Dawn now. Blade. Hello, thank you very much for the follow. At this rate, I might have to. I'm gonna do like a big giveaway when I get to 350. I was thinking of doing it at 300, and then a lot of stuff IRL happened and I wasn't able to do it, but so I'm gonna make up for it by doing like an even bigger one at 350. I'm gonna give away so much stuff. All of the things. Yeah, I remember Sun Sun was like. I wonder if it's the same Sun Sun that played Blade and Soul. I knew someone else in a different game who was also named Sun Sun, who was one of those people. He was free to play and like one of the most geared people on our server because all he did day in and day out was just grind. Like, he would just sit there just grinding for hours on end. Like, he wouldn't talk to people, he would just be grinding. Like, I was in a guild with him at one point. And yes, it's fully. For a long time on NA, I was the top blade dancer. My, um, archival channel actually has, like, some montages I made of, like, Oh look, blade dancer got reworked, so now we have to flash step all over the place. Here's, like, a montage of me, like, doing flash steps. It's- Blade Dancer is such a fun class. My only problem with it was that we had to put in so much work to like do what other classes did by just existing. There we go, and now I had Fort Leaf Clover somewhere. Where like my previous like Like, I was super proud of my flashed up dealing like four bill. Like, no, like two billion. And then, like, my blade dance, my blade master friend was like, mine does four. I'm like, okay. <laughs> okay. But it was funny because one time we, like, really needed bursts and I'd been saving my flash steps. And so, like, a friend of mine picked up the boss, and I was like, "My soul is up. My weapon is ready. I have four. F I have four or five flash steps. My Z is up. Let's go!" And I did like ten billion damage in two seconds. It was hilarious because the boss still had like ten percent HP left, and then it just died, and everyone was like, "What just happened?" <laughs> I was like, yay. Good luck, potion. Oh, I need to I need to buff up to make this. Blainzo was quite a lot of fun. Mobby is more persistent fun, I would say though. Like, I don't know, the Oh, hello! 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 Cute fox. Ah, wah, 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 wah. Hi. 
Nope. I might actually change my in-game name to match my Twitch in a bit. I don't know. I kind of want to leave it as is, though. But I mean, like, once I ch like, I'm waiting for my cust all of my new custom assets to come in, and then I want to switch over like the naming. Either that or the three hundred, which out three fifty, whichever comes first. I'll swap at that time, I think. Um, why am I blinking? I can't keep focused at all right now. Okay, good luck, potion. There we go, 100% success rate. Thank you. Aw, oh, thank you, Starfire. So, I remember getting asked at one point, someone was like, why do you type in, like, very short, um, sentences? And I was like, Mobby made me like this, because it would delete my sentences if they were too long without saying anything. I was like, why? Please. It took me, like, a minute to type that. See, like that. Uh. Yup. Oh, it is definitely still a thing. Okay. Four, five, failure, failure. Why am I failing so much? I'm already a, this is like a 60% success rate. Okay. Okay. I'm also getting exhausted, so I'm wondering if I like. I'm gonna switch title. I'm gonna switch tax and just run stuff. Yeah, yeah. Is there anything you would like to run? Um. Hmm. I have probably Phantasm Mirror World, but I'm told that's not very good. Yeah, Mirror World is a significantly watered down version that doesn't really give too much. Do you want to do Phantasm Normal though? <clears throat> I have passes for it oh, already yeah. if you want. Yeah, I'm into Normal. Okay. All I have, have otherwise is Pika, Abyss, and some Elite Pets. Okay. Andrew, you want to come too? Foley, do you want to come? If not, then I will ask Star. Because that'll be four. I mean, as long as you don't mess up the gunning mechanic at the end, it's fine. Um... If you don't want to come, though, that's fine. Star will also come if you don't want to. It's up to you. 
totes okay. No pressure. Oh, you've never done it. Shiggy, I'm just taking people their phantasm. Phantasm. I like phantasm. It's very fun. I like phantasm. I like to do the dirt things. And I like to I like to do the things. <laughs> And sometimes it's even a thingy thingy. It's even a Stardust quest. I'm just lazy. Lazy bone. Lazy floof. Oh no, Magmel? Absolutely not. Oh yeah, I need to do a bunch of that. A star said that they don't want to come. They might have to go out and step out and do something. So that's okay. In that case, Foley, you can be our fourth. Uh, just stick with me and you'll be fine. I like inviting people to do stuff. But even if they like can't necessarily handle it on their own, like it's kind of fun to be able to run stuff like that sometimes, you know? Uh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Thank you. I don't think we'll have a problem. We shall not. Thank you, yeah. Sully! Wait. Welcome! <laughs> Thank yous for the heart switch! Isn't this emote adorable? I love this. This is such a fun emote. I really, really like this one. Is it because of the big boobs? No, it's because of everything! It's so cute overall! And... A certain special... And... It was drawn by none other than Yuyake! Give her a round of applause. <laughs> Why'd you have to say that? I, I said it before on stream and you were okay at that. Oh no. That's embarrassing. It's, it's fine though. What do you mean? It's such a good emote! I asked you a while ago if it was okay to say that and you were like, yeah. I didn't know that. That doesn't mean it's not embarrassing. <laughs> That's also... Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> So, Zvoli, stick with me and you will be a-okay. That's all my physical powers. What is today? I'll just use a light. Today is Tuesday. Yes, thank you. <laughs> Head Pat Haven! Welcome! All right, ready? Everyone? Everyone's on the altar? Yeah, you're on the altar? Uh, yes, yes. Okay. I'm just wondering how my eyes save lives. Also, I love the music in Phantasm. Let me turn off the this one. I can turn off the Phantasm. It's very, music. very good. It's, the music in Phantasm is really good. Actually relaxing. It is. Turn it on myself. Um, actually, we can do this one. The first few rooms, uh, Svoli are pretty easy. See? NBD, you got this too. 
You're worried. Also, you might want to change your title. What were you saying, Mia? The only thing I'm worried about is hallway, but I think you can handle that. So. Yeah. It's just the only thing I know I can't personally handle. Yep, yep. Since I... Oh, that was a normal smash. Damn. Okay. I don't even have Overture on right now. Wait, what's my max? Uh, that's not terrible. Corgi, get up. I mean, not the music is a little too loud or anything like that. There we go. That might be a little more reasonable. <clears throat> oh, and in these hallways, there's dust on the ground that you need to avoid stepping on or you'll create more dolls. I'll take the back then. Oh, my bad. And BD. Here you can either anchor rush through these, use Divine Link uh, as they're spawning in. There's quite a few different ways you can get around the Wraith Wars. They're not enough of a bother to me in this room to like really make it worthwhile though. But um, if you want to make sure that you have your pets You'll want to anchor rush, learn to anchor rush through those. Oh, you already did hallway. Nice. It's so nice. Like, everyone has become so strong. Compared to like, especially when I first started like having, like running Phantasm with everyone. You should be proud of yourselves. Look at how far you've come. I remember when you first brought me here, and even being in a room with you, I would die. <laughs> mm-hmm. And now you can solo rooms. Yeah. It's so... It warms my heart to see everyone's progress. My yep. worst room is the one with all the little baby succubi. Mm -hmm. But I can do it. It just takes me a little longer. Oh, wow. You can do that one now? Nice. Oh, yeah. Like, I, I'm not really in threat of dying in there, but I just have to do fireballs, and that's a little slower than Hailstorm. Nice. Big brain mode. And I would say Phantasm is harder than normal techs, but not as hard as elite tech. Like, coming up, we have Hallway, which, under normal circumstances, is kind of a pain, but... Um, here it's NBD. The original strategy for getting through Hallway was that you would farm flashbangs like let the first run fail so that you got more time and then you would just go with flashbangs and use those to burst through. Yeah, 
I didn't get to switch my weapon back. Also, just as a piece of advice to people who like are worried about their survivability, if you can get three whales, you'll be in amazing shape. Alright, next is hallway. Give me a sec to switch into final hit gear. And as much as I don't like the ping, I think I want install flame for the cleave boost. I did the room with all the switches. It feels good. Yeah, congrats. <laughs> I was surprised. Like, you've actually gotten so good. Like, I'm proud of you. You are so good now. Good job. Thank you. Excellent work. I'll only get better. Uh-huh. Uh, give me a sec to fate weave. Chee ba ba, chee ba ba, chee ba ba. Chee ba ba, chee ba ba, chee ba ba. Chee ba ba, chee ba ba, chee ba ba. And we're done. <laughs> Make that look so fun. <laughs> Let me switch back to my DPS gear. Come on, let me hit you both, and... Dang, no crit. That's unfortunate. Ooh, I got a crit with my Blazing Assault Slash. You die now. I'm in support shining. Thank you. Thank you very much. Don't open the door yet. Uh, let me explain to Svalia what we have to do. Okay, so. Um, two things. One, as soon as the fight starts go behind one of the lamps if you... Oh, could you please get my pet up here? Thank you. If you follow me, you'll see where to stand. We need to stand behind the brazier so that the queen and her succubi can't get at us. And then we're just gonna drop meteors on their heads. Over and over and over again. If she tell the only other thing that's dangerous is if she teleports next to you and you see yourself get knocked down. Um, you have to pull out your guns, uh, dual guns, and shoot her as fast as you can. You have to land like 26 hits or something, and you're the only person who can do it. There'll be a green gauge at the bottom. It's like when gear grabs you or any other like hit count, like Irizam. You'll have to deal with that. Yes. Either guns or dual wielding. So long as you have like... Do you have the blanded guns? Uh, I carry a spare set of guns just in case of situations like this. So I can lend you a pair. Do you need me to lend you a pair? Okay, just remember to get them back afterwards, please. They should be inside Scooter. Yep. Uh, the... Don't worry about the small succubi during that. They all de-aggro and just walk over to the queen. A 
Also, these are my guns. I love their design. I really like these guns. I need to finish ranking them up, though. Alright. Um, if you succeed, she'll get knocked down. After that, just, um... Attack her. Like, a uh, load counter attack, sorry. She'll run over to you and try to kick you in the face. If uh, you succeed and you counter on the crit, you'll remove some of her clothes. Each time you do this, the worth of a potential drop from her spikes several orders of magnitude. Well, not several. It'll spike an order of magnitude. If you do it twice and then get the drop, that one spikes an order of magnitude. I think it's like 20 mil for the base. I think it's like two to anywhere from 2 to 20 mil for the base. 70 mil if you do it once, but like 2 bill if you do it twice and get it. Anyway, just be ready to drop your meteors. Ready, everyone? Uh, since I'm an elemental knight, I just channel them through my sword. Let me buff everyone. Ah, no. Just ne? Buff. Buff, buff, buff. Buff, buff, buff. I'm not that good at buffing. Oh, right. I don't have cores on anymore. Um, I'll try one more time. Eh, that's good enough. Alright, off we go. Thinking of a meteor storm. Gonna pop you in the head with the meteor. Behind the pillar. Make sure that you do not stay out in the open. And we're done. Yeah, everyone here runs this a lot. Yeah. <laughs> if you get lucky and she doesn't do her mechanic early on, it just turns into everyone just blows her up with meteors. It's actually pretty hilarious. Thanks for coming. Y'all want to close out with maybe some advanced text? Okay. Okay. I'll see you there. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I definitely agree, Jonza. Like before, it was a little iffy, but I think now everyone's at a point where that would be viable. Where we could even just like, if we had the passes for it, we could farm for it. Okay. Um, at the Giara, we'll probably just do some Feth Advanced and then call it a night and then raid on someone else, do a few runs. I'm a secret multitasker. Oh, thank you for the gun. <laughs> thank you for returning my guns. Ah, no saw. Ah, kochi, kochi, kochi. Ah, turn it. That was bad. Uh, do you still have your revived illusion elite? I do, yeah. How many? How much time is left on it? 
I have Revive Delusion Elite, 9 days, and 10 days. Okay. I think we could close out with one of those. I think, so I think I this... Should... Hmm? I should go get a dye bottle then, right? Uh, I will get you one, yes. Um... But we'll do... Dronzo, what do you have? But yeah, we will do just Feth Advance for a little bit. Just warm up. Very low... Like... Impact. Oh, we're doing Feth instead? Uh, Feth Advance just to warm up and stuff. Just to ease into it. Instead of jumping straight to Elite. And then after that, we'll do one Feth Advanced. And then do the shorter of your two revived illusions and then maybe we can close out with like a seven elite from Jonza. what do you think about that too much or i'm fine with that i'm just worried about your sleep schedule oh you're right we I might just make sure i don't know if what like, you're doing tomorrow that's all oh you're right i do have to be up early so let's do just the Feth Advanced and the Revived Illusion Elite, and we'll go from there. Like, see what time looks like at that point. Thank you for the reminder. I needed that. Appreci You're welcome. Yeah, appreciate it. All right. So, Advanced Feth first. Yeah, what I was going to tell you was that this entire time, I've been extremely sneaky. You've been... And I've been playing Animal Crossing at the same time. <laughs> wow, you're OP. You haven't noticed. <laughs> Phantasm so easy now, you can play Animal Crossing at the same time. <laughs> yeah. Die. I'm not going to tell you that 90% of that was being on a load screen going somewhere, because that's 90% of the game. <laughs> <laughs> you're not wrong. <laughs> I remember thinking about that at the same time when I was watching you play it. It was like, oh, it takes so long. It truly does. Did I rotate my camera around? Am I just blind? I wasn't looking. I was itchy. I know where it spawns. I think I just went off the wrong way. Hold on. Let me reset. Because it was like we start here. Oh, I found it. It goes up here. It's where you, it's where you went the first time. It's yeah, that's what I thought. I was like, it's supposed I to go up you. here. Uh yeah, I just went too far north a little bit. I don't know why I do that a lot. Uh, interestingly, Feth Elite is um, deterministic spawn. Like the order is actually deterministic. Um, this one, I went to where three is, I think, instead of where two is. Like, three is, like, diagonally down right, I think. This only applies to, um, advanced, by the way. You know, that makes sense, because I noticed when I was doing this that the orb was always in the same spot. Mm-hmm. And that's why I went back here, because I was like, doesn't yeah. it go over here? Yeah, and it three, was. three is the one that's always like super right close behind us. And then after this, it's, um... This is, the next one is like the annoying one. And then after that, I where that it's one is. hallway. Where's everyone? I'm alone! You. <laughs> it was right behind us. Oh. Die. I think I was following Jaranza and Jaranza was following me. With like minor adjustments to where we were going. Oh. No, you're silly. <laughs> Smash. And then here's the annoying part where we have to do the orbs. Since this is advanced though, I can just final hit this. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot to overture first. Whoops. My B. I'll get the first two. Three. Four. My Someone else get the last one. There. Orb. No! Someone please do orb duty. I'll get the first three. Oh, that's unfortunate. There we go. Four. Uh, okay. One. Wait, what? Hold on. Let me overture. Just skip this one. There we go. Maybe I forgot to overture. Up. Oh. Oops, oh, sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six. No! Aragis was on orb duty, but denable any luck. Two, three, four, five. Okay. Oh wait, let me. Let me make sure I can do this without critting with this. One. Two, three, four, five. There. I just always just... forget. Hmm? Oh, sorry. No, I was just saying like I just forget to like buff myself up all the way sometimes. When I'm like just. That's the jumping. hallway on the level I told you. I can make it all the way to the art, but I can smack it fast enough. Mhm. Mm like soloing it. Debuff or my buff off. Okay, oh, bye. Big crit. <laughs> Here's the next one. And then after this, it's like backwards over here. Yeah. Okay. This is where we're gonna have a tap them. I'll just hit the tap them with a quick combo. That should kill it. Alright, so we're here, follow me. And then after this one, it's like way down there, I think. Yeah. You're casting, I'll hit the orb for us. Nice ones. There was a time in this game when I thought the slimes were cute. I know, right? My feelings have changed. Alright, follow me. And then next is Orb Hallway. Oh, no. Give me a sec. Ah, right. Nice. If you have the two on, like, outside here is where you want to put down the debuff, usually. Oh, I got a bit of help. After we clear this, but before we go into the orb, let me, um, use Joyful Chapati. My favorite thing is, like, watching a bunch of them spawn, and then just hitting them with the animal. 
I missed. Satisfying, isn't it? It really is. Like doing the big lion through. All right, don't don't hit the orb yet. What's this pretty circle? That's the two on that slows them down. Everyone in the bus. Get on the bus. Joyful Japari Paka. Okay. Dragon out. so much I went somewhere really weird. <laughs> Blade meteor. Hit by nothing. Goodbye. Thank you. It was harassing me. <laughs> Thank you for getting the pad up. Alright. Good luck everyone. Eroded mineral trunk. Oh, look, an elite feth. Actually, wait, did I? I think I forgot to actually go get level 7. Oh, look, I just got an elite feth too. Donut beam turns you into chocolate. No, it turns you into Swiss cheese. Drills holes through you. Over to you. <laughs> I like the pun. That's pretty good. The Facebook Angie face? I don't have a Facebook, so I don't know what that looks like. I have one, and I don't know what that looks like. <laughs> Thank you. So, are we all ready for this? Yep, yep. You oh, wait, 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 no, no, we're not. Uh, die bottles. Hold on, let me go to my homestead and get them. Um, I'm assuming we need three. Svoli, do you have a die bottle, glittering die bottle? I have two. I just gathered three. Okay. Um, you use it for an easy way to do the orb rooms. I will teach you once we start. Uh, so you'll see rooms in here where there's someone kneeling on the floor. Avoid those rooms. We will take those together. Oh, I have... Oh, okay. And Indra, do you have any? If not, I have spares. I went and just gathered a bunch just in case. Basic enchant scrolls also work too, but I use these just- I mean, beginner enchant scrolls work too, but I just like- oh, I have to split that first. That's- uh, that's not letting me divide Hey! Anything. This guy right here! He's named after the HM Surf! Wait. Yes! HM Will that strength? That's strength. <laughs> oh, because he's a giant, I yes. guess. Yes, HMO3 is Surf. Oh, it's a girl, and there's a panda hat. Oh my gosh. Super cute. <laughs> I didn't know there was a panda hat. Panda hat. Let's go. I want it. That's... Oh. I, I like that method of calling yourself strong. That's cool.
All right. Did you say we're ready, sorry? Uh, I gave Drones a dye bottle. You have dye bottles on you? You said you have two? Yeah? Uh, yes, yes, sorry. I guess you didn't hear me. Uh-huh. I was just confirming. And then... Spoli has one. Okay. So again, avoid these rooms. Like, you see how there's a person on the room there? Do not go in there. We will tackle those together after we get the orb rooms first. Oh, okay. I... This fully doesn't know the trick, so... I'll solo one room. Y'all can divide up the other room as you'll please. I uh, wanted to test my memory on it. Mm -hmm. So I'll see if I'm right. Uh-huh. I don't remember where I put my combat thoughts. Uh, let's use this one. I apologize in advance if you die. <laughs> oh, we're doing pretty well together. Good job. Come on. Come on. Oh, wait. I forgot to summon my fourth doll bag. And then... Phantasma. Oh, this is easier than I remember it. Mm-hmm. This barely feels like a late... Okay, looks like we are done with the three orb rooms. Okay. So we're going to split into groups of two. Um, I'll demonstrate first with Yuya, and then Elidris and Jonza, you can do the other room. So you're going to want to pick one person as the lead, and then the other person as the uh, secondary. So, what you're going to do is angle your camera so that you can see the person in the room and that you can see their feet. Oh, Yuya, do you have mana issues with that? Yeah, that's why I put down a glyph. Okay, let me do this one. You actually do have to put it down over here. It has to be up there. <clears throat> uh. Okay. Can you go to the middle, please? Okay. So, what you do is the primary clicks on the feet of the person sitting in the circle. And then as they pass the person in the middle, they use their dye bottle. Similarly, the person in the middle then clicks on the feet of that person as well as the lead gets near them. And then they do the same thing. They just need to use their dye, the secondary just has to use their dye bottle before they get through the doors. If you do it right, the doors will close and you'll start taking lots and lots of fire damage. E, are you ready? Um, your explanation actually confused me. I don't understand. Um, I was explaining mostly for the others, but I'll just, for you, when I go past you, click at their feet and use the bottle. What, did that uh, did that help? Yes. Okay. Ready? That made a lot more sense to me. Okay. Yes. All right. Do it when I go past you. Ready, set, and go. And now we just sit here. See how the door closed? So right now we've um, essentially enforced displacement. You're not allowed to move at this point. So I can't move anymore or it'll warp me into the room. But right now the game believes that I'm in there standing in the circle and Yuya's standing there with me. So this room... I... Hmm? What'd you say? I'm not getting hurt. Did I not do it correct? No, they just haven't spawned in yet. 
So the longer you stand in the two circles, the more enemies spawn in and their goal is to try to knock you out of the circle. You need to click on their feet, not on their legs, not on their head. You need to point at their feet. And the idea there is if you do that, um, about halfway through the room, salamanders start spawning and they drop fire aliens all over the place and you'll take damage from that, but the other enemies can't hit you because technically you're out here, but you're actually on the circle in there. So yes, as was just said and written, same thing. And then you and Dronza are going to do it over there. Oh no, the sudden sleepies. Aww. Thanks, Rich. You gonna lurk or actually head out? And remember, hydrate or die. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Take care of yourself. Sleep well. Yep. And then just click and use it. You have that entire walk up but just have your inventory open and ready with the dye bottle and then just control click on it to use it. Oh, I did do it right? Yeah, we're taking damage, good. We might have taken a while to actually start up though, so I think my glyph ran out. Yeah, I don't see it in there. Good luck, you two. Good luck. If you need extra explanation, don't be afraid. You actually have quite a bit of wiggle room with this method. It's just to get you like synced up for the most part. But you have quite a bit of wiggle room. So as long as you do it, you'll be fine. Edris, you need to go quickly. You haven't moved yet. They pull it off? Um, no. I only saw Dranza do it. Me? Dranza did it, but oh, we're done. Cool. Now we just gotta kill the room. Ah. This is my second time. <laughs> yep, good job. much damage the last time. Yeah, you took way less damage this time. Good job. Last time I actually died, remember? Yeah, you were taking way more. I'm still like, is this really a lead? It really was. I clicked the pass. Oh, I know. It just feels like different. Oh, I still had an install flame on, duh. Alright, cool. I'll use divine thingy. I'll go in there and I'll also just tank. I think it'll be fun. Maybe. Possibly. Hold on, let me look in there. A little risky. It's getting pretty tiny. Yeah. Iron wheel and chill. <laughs> oh, 
Uh-oh. Hmm? I poured a Dranza in. Did it really? Yeah, he's right underneath of you. Oh, no. Interesting. No, I know. I think it was my Shield of Trust that did it. Oh, because it corrects your displacement. Yeah. And he was technically there, so he got hit by it. Yeah. He has to Iron Will, and I have... I take ones from this, so NBD. And I have um, Shield of Trust up. Nice work. And yeah, I just like using Divinity here, because you can't be knocked back as a Divinity. This is like, if you mess up and you get knocked into the room, this is the backup strat. You either sit there in Iron Will in your normal form, or you sit here in Divinity. I like to use Divinity first, and then swap into Iron Will after. That's good to know. It's a good teaching experience. Thank you. I'm gonna use Celestial Spike. I'm gonna get more energy for Nova. Should have held a little bit longer. Let's just blink. Let's stop the divinity. We're good. Like some cool beans. Mm -hmm. Here in Canada, we like maple beans. Good job, everyone. <clears throat> All right, so this one is a little bit trickier. Someone has to go to the back to talk to the NPCs, and then uh, I would like it if you uh, don't do that. I, I wasn't like... going to. Yeah, I was just going to stand there. Oh, okay. I like it if you would come up here with me. Stand about here, and me? on. Yeah. And then on my cue, Dance of Death. All right. It'll be like in a bit. And then Aragis, if you could go over there and talk to the NPCs. There's a Gaiata that spawns and we have to kill the Gaiata as quickly as possible while um, also defending those, en those NPCs in the middle from an onslaught of enemies. So yes. Um, I'm going to do... Exploit, time shift, denival, all that good stuff. I'm gonna show you something new I learned too. Oh. Uh, Hopefully it's helpful. Okay. Uh, almost. Not quite ready yet. Oh, I need to do two things. One, I'm gonna put this up just in case. Two, I'm gonna fantastic cores just in case. Do this. All right, let's go. Just please go talk to the NPC. And show me what you learned. Go ahead, dance of death. Um, I'm gonna cut some This is what I learned. The shock. Oh, good idea. You can barely see. <laughs> That was really unlucky. I barely quit it all. Come on, let me crit. There we go.
Cool. Clear. Good job. <clears throat> So that was most of the hard part done. So now we have halfway. So here's the thing. There's um the monolith. Um, it's just really annoying. Uh, there are two rooms that can spawn. There's ones that have monoliths in them, and then there's ones that have red wi red witches in them. Sorry, English. So, like, you see how there's a monolith in the middle of that room? That tells you that's a monolith room. This orb in the middle is not a monolith. Yep, thank you. And then... The witches will reflect 25% of the damage that you deal back at you. Um... Bypassing mono shield. You can negate that with blessing of protection. Um, but um, if you're using your one-handed spirit's ultimate skill, that also works too. You can heal. Um, so generally, it's just you want to make sure that you uh, kill them pretty well. The ones with the... Um... So yeah. It's pretty good. Is bow protections? What do you mean bow protections? Oh, the... What, the blessing of protection? Uh... You use it before you attack it, so that you're invincible when the reflect goes off. I like to just chug pots through the reflection. Though if I like crit on Dinobolt, sometimes it can nearly take me out. Alright, I'll do this room. Y'all can take on the mana shoot do that room over there with the monolith. Alright. Alright. Hello, dude guy. How are you? Oh. Just started. Okay. Dreamer, how are you today? Thank you for the raid! <laughs> How's everything? Thank you so much for the raid! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Let me do a... And I wanted a mod to do this earlier and I forgot. Um, for Ronnie. I'll do that for Ronnie afterward. Dreamer, how are you doing? Yes. There's a shout out for you. Thank you ever so much for it the raid. It must have been the nine months with one of my subs, right? <laughs> so how is everything going? Oh, I should probably save him for me. Come on, Kogi. Okay. How was your stream? Thank you so much for the raid! And then, let's also do one for Ronnie. Um, let's see. You're not booping my state? A city? Oh! Almost. More like this. Nice! I'm glad that you're able to relax now. Relaxing is the bestest. Oh. I made a mistake!
It's just that I denivolted two witches at the same time, and the reflect really almost wrecked me. I actually might run my first Chrom 80% tomorrow, depending on how I do. I'm excited. I gotta study. Study! But I'll do my best. I also ordered, like, so a huge load of emotes that I'm, like, really, really excited for. There's, like, a bunch of them. Pain Pico! Uh, I can't get my cargo out of here. Let's do something. Uh, if you die and you're not sure that you can re like survive the room, uh, you power up the boss every time you die, so just be careful about that. Okay, I haven't died yet. Good job. Is this pain pecking? Uh huh. Please down. send help. Yeah, I'm here. I don't have divine link up, but I'm taking most of the other. I didn't even notice you were here. <laughs> I die. Let's take Dauntless. Get these three in the middle, where everyone else is away from them. I should have enough even if I crit myself here. Cool beans. Get away from the salamanders if the puddle deals a lot of damage to you, I'm gonna kill them. There we go. Goodbye. Papa. Alright, so at this point, all we have to do is- oh wait, there's one more room. After this, we've just got to deal with the boss, and the main thing that to be aware of there is that- Um... Oh, blah, blah, blah. Oh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Hello, Peru. You always scare me with that. Your timing is so good. I feel like you wait until I'm like unnerved or like the most relaxed and then you're just like wham! Nail me every time. Good job. I think everyone's really gonna like all the new emotes though. I'm like super excited for it. I think it's been like a month and a half since I commissioned also like a custom overlay. So I'm really looking forward to that being done too. Oh, did my doll bag just expire? Oh no. Let's switch to my backup doll bag. Okay. Hello everyone who is arriving from Dream. Thank you for coming by. Hopefully you'll enjoy what I'm doing. Just running with some elite text with my friends and people from stream as well. I like playing with all of my friends and helping everyone as well. I like giving advice, I like running things with people, I like being able to show them some of the higher end things as well. And yep, that does happen. 
even like I can partially one shot myself with a crit. I think I have I have enough HP and protection so that I usually don't. But if I crit more than one witch at a time, I can instantly deadly myself. Okay, let me uh, drop a quick buff. I will also go ahead and just give us the green buff. And I guess with that, since I'm no longer using my helm for buffing, I can go ahead and reroll, like, enchant resistance on it instead. I'll, re I'll enchant that afterward. Did I remember to remove the resistance enchant? I have a question. Yes? Is Living Dreamer the one from our Len run? Yes! Oh, okay, the funny one. Yes, Harry me me hell. I, I, I bit my tongue. <laughs> Harry me hell. I'm probably horribly mispronouncing your name as well. The I'm big giant lady. Yes, the pretty big giant lady. The pretty one with the blue and the pink. With the big sword. Yeah. Okay. Ready, everyone? Oh! <laughs> Why ask if you're gonna click it? <laughs> I wasn't trying to. I was trying to, like... <laughs> um, I think I can... Okay. You see the buff that is on the boss? That goes away if it stands in the fire hole. Multi-hit time. Just hit it quickly. And what's that buff do? It makes it take less damage. It's not necessarily something I have to be super worried about, though. Let me see. Do I... Nice. Oh, save me! Good. Thankfully, there's no limit on potions here, so this is where I spend all of my, like, comprehensive 1000s that I don't use anywhere else. Come on, please walk into a fire pit so I can actually time shift on you. Oh, you're way over there. Wow, that doesn't even- Somehow, break. he got the impression we were friends. <laughs> he just invited himself over. I was also like, that doesn't even break your mana shield anymore. That's kind of cool. Watch the fires. Oh. Okay, he dropped you're his right. debuff. When we get low on HP, it's gonna go invincible and make four copies of itself around the room. We're gonna need to kill those four copies. Here, it's starting. One, down. Two down. I think they're all down. Nice, good job. Let's get it. Uh, they're using life drain. That's unfortunate. Here we go. Ow. Oh, the music turned off. That's odd. so bad yeah we like really the hard part of this run is at the start like once you get past the midpoint you're essentially home free come on big lucky Aww. oh 
Ooh, hard crystallized mineral. I haven't gotten one of those in a while. Time to celebrate our victory. A victory pose. Break dancing, <laughs> yeah. Nice move. <laughs> Thank you. I'm just out derping. This is oddly on beat. <laughs> I'm gonna do this once we actually if if I'm allowed to do eighty percent tomorrow and I clear, I think we're gonna do it. I'm only gonna do it. <laughs> Did you see that? We were in sync. Oh, that's cool. With the same gesture. Wow. <laughs> that's my son. Everyone is derping. This is great. <laughs> it's lovely to just have fun together and derp out. Today was super fun. I'm very glad that I was able to stream and have fun with everyone. I should be going to bed soon, so I'm gonna go ahead and just see who else is streaming and I will raid us out onto someone else. Let's see. I'll go ahead and raid us out onto Midens, who is also streaming Mobby. Gotta keep the raid train going. Thank you all ever so much for coming today. I hope you enjoyed the stream, and I hope to see you around another time. Hopefully, maybe even in the future, I might switch over to Aki. I need to do some more rigging streams so I can actually get her rigged more and like try out version 5. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. I am truly grateful for your support, and I hope to see you again in the near future. Also, Please come back once I get to like 350. I'll do like a huge giveaway and give a void a bunch of stuff. So please let your friends know and I hope to see you in the future. Good night everyone. Stay safe, take care, and I hope you'll all have a wonderful fantasy life. They're mine now. <laughs> Thank you T3 Cowboys. Thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate it. I'll see you around. And with that,